Yep. I'm with Lee Sinnett, Games Maturity Manager. Uh, first time at the North End for me this season, Lee. Mm -hmm. So what can I expect from your team? Or what do you hope from your team today? I mean, what we're looking to do is to uh, to build on the uh, the success that we've had so far. And I know it's early on in the season, it's, well, it's the fifth game. But uh, we're just looking to make improvements all the time. Ask questions of the opposition. Uh, obviously, to uh, you know, to create chances, you know, for the uh, for the team to uh, to execute. So, uh, uh, yeah, really looking forward to today. Um, you know, it's uh, you know, it's another home game, which, which is good. And uh, you know, looking to uh, to play the football that we've asked the players to play, and that, you know that uh, requires bravery. You know, getting the ball down, you know, passing the ball, and like I mentioned earlier on, he's, he's making opportunities. So uh, you know, hopefully we can execute them. Playing the bottom of the table, mm -hmm. does that cause its own problems in terms of the dressing room and you trying to tell your players about complacency? Well, that, that I mean, is this going to be their probably their, I think personally their biggest test maybe the season because right on paper. I, yeah, I can understand it, where you're coming from. Uh, I mean, we've mentioned it to the players obviously after Monday's game, training on on Thursday night. That we treat everybody equal, and I know it's an old saying, but you have to have that mental framework in your head. Whereas you just see a team out there, you know, you don't relate to what the table tells you, what their past results have, 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 uh, have told you. Because otherwise, your mind is starting to wonder, in my view. And uh, we treat everybody with the same respect. I've always done that, uh, whether, you know, uh, whatever league position, like I mentioned before. So that's one thing that I'm going to be watching in the dressing room before the game. Uh, I'll be most certainly watching it in the warm-up, and I'll pick them up on it if I feel that you know I'm not too happy about things. But the players know where me and John are coming from, and, Ch and Charlie, the goalkeeping coach, and Rich Physio, that uh, you know the mental approach to a game is, is for me <laughs> as important, if not a little bit more important than, than other aspects, because uh, the mind can play tricks, can't it? And uh, if you treat people with disrespect. Then you're going to, uh, you know, you, you're going to have a problem. And uh, I mean, it's a long season, isn't it? It's 42 games, so the squad are going to have to show mental strength. I mean, with the fifth game into it, what are we, the third week into it? It's a long, long season, isn't it? They're going to have to show mental strength throughout the season, you know, in different forms. So everybody's treated completely the same. And uh, uh, you know, I mean, I was speaking to Rob earlier on that um, you know, they managed to do something that we didn't do it that much on the opening day and scored two goals. So you know, you, you have to be aware. But in saying that. We have to be um, also confident of, of what we can do, and I think we've shown so far that we can ask teams questions, and that's what we're looking to do today. The first question, question was, you know, what can I expect? Well, that's what I'm expecting is to ask Lancaster, uh, you know, serious questions. In, in terms of the squad, uh, mm -hmm. a complete change from last season. Mm -hmm. uh, is it a better squad? I know you've dropped down a, a league, but mm -hmm. is it a better squad? Do you feel more at ease with this squad? Well, of course, I mean, coming in in February, I mean, you know, it's, it's a bit of the magic wand <laughs> scenario. Yeah. Unfortunately, that wasn't being able to be pulled off. Uh, you mentioned, I mean, a third of the squad remained, but there's two thirds new. They've gelled extremely well. You, you can feel it growing in the dressing room. That, that obviously transports itself onto the training pitch and then on, onto games. So, um, yeah, they've all gelled very well. Um, in regards to, you know, is it better than last season or, or, or whatever? I mean, I, I don't go down on that road. I mean, that, that's done. Uh, we didn't want to suffer the consequences, which we did do in the end. But I mean, we're building to get out of this division and to operate, uh, in my personal view, better in the in the Conference North and maybe for a few seasons. Well, good luck today, Lee, and uh, I'm looking forward to watching your team play today. All right, thank you. Thank you.